its fully retracted position. This should occur at the five minute mark in the count. The swing arm now coming back as our countdown continues. Skip Chauvin informing the astronauts that the swing arm now coming back. Four minutes and counting, we are go for Apollo 11. We'll be coming up in the automatic sequence about 10 or 15 seconds from this time. The vehicle starting to pressurize as far as the propellant tanks are concerned, and all is still go as we monitor our status for it. Firing command coming in now. We're on an automatic sequence as the master computer supervises hundreds of events occurring over these last few minutes. Two minutes, 10 seconds, and counting. Oxidizer tanks in the second and third stages now have pressurized. T minus one minute, 35 seconds. The third stage completely pressurized. T minus 60 seconds and counting. We pass T minus 60. 55 seconds and counting. Neil Armstrong reported back when he received the good wishes. Thank you very much. We know it will be a good flight. Good luck and Godspeed. 40 seconds away from the Apollo 11 liftoff. All the second stage tanks now pressurized. 35 seconds and counting. We are still go with Apollo 11. 30 seconds and counting. Astronauts report it feels good. T minus 25 seconds. 20 seconds and counting. T minus 15 seconds. Guidance is internal. 12, 11, 10, 9. Ignition sequence start. 6.
Stand by for mode one, Charlie. Mark, mode one, Charlie. One, Charlie. This is Houston, you are go for staging. Board cut off. Come in, board cut off. We confirm, skirt step. Tower's gone. Roger, tower. When Apollo was safely underway, control of the mission was switched to Houston. The months of tightly focused work at the Cape were over. It could honestly be said that this was the culmination of the dreams and fantasies of men and women over 25 centuries of recorded time. Jay, Tom Payne, James Webb, Marconi Gilroy, John Hubo, Debus, Laplace, Goddard, Descartes, Marie Curie, Albert Hirsch,